Hi, Christy here, continuing this series from the ancient healing art of Jinshin Jitsu, similar to acupuncture using gentle touch instead of needles. Today we're talking about the, I always get it wrong, the sixth depth. The sixth depth is a little more esoteric, I think. It, it, you come from the seventh depth and you come down into the sixth depth. There's a whole story of how creation happens. And this one, the color is red. I didn't wear red again today. Oh well, it's the deepest ruby red. And the element is primordial fire. This has a lot to do with cos the cosmos and divine energy and being connected to heaven and earth. Umbilicus is born here, as is uh, the diaphragm flow. Capricorn and Sagittarius are the two signs that are associated with it. There are a couple cool little quotes at the bottom of this. I am the divine flame and also the blueprint of life. So mental, emotional, despair, not feeling centered, depressive moods, stress, burnout syndrome, helps create emotional balance and foster spiritual harmony. Again, these cards are from Health in Your Hands from Walter Rodriguez Krauss. Physical fatigue, exhaustion, it strengthens your genes. I love that idea. And harmonizes breath and thoughts. And in the uh, Touch of Healing book, again, I love how they list all the, the different associations. The function is a source of life. The, the finger, if you will, is the center of the palm, and I, I sometimes do it by holding them both at the same time, which is kind of efficient. Or you can just hold one, either way. And it's all about being who you are in this lifetime. One of the other ways you can harmonize it is by giving yourself a big hug. Your hands are around the back. So I would love to hear what you think of being the divine flame. I love that idea. That sounds really empowering and part of all there is. Love to hear how you feel about being a divine flame. Look forward to seeing you in the next video. And in the meantime, please go be brilliant.